is a principle in physics known as Hooke's Law, which states that if I was to get an elastic object, like a spring, and attach weights onto it, then it would extend by a length that's proportional to that weight. Now, in detail, what this means, that say I was to attach a 100 gram weight onto the spring, and that caused it to extend, to stretch by half a centimeter, then if I was to double that weight to 200 grams, then it would extend by double the length. So to a whole centimeter. And this continues. So with 400 grams, it would extend by two centimeters. 800 grams, it would extend by four centimeters. And this goes on and on, like I said, but as soon as you take the weights off, the spring, because it hasn't reached what's known as its elastic limit, returns to its original length. So let's try another spring. And again, let's add weights onto it. And yes, it extends. But take these weights off, and this one doesn't return to its original length. Until I take it off this clamp and dip it in this hot water here. And you can see that it does return to its original length. So why is this spring acting different to the first spring? Take a look at these possible answers and click on the one that you think best describes what's going on here. Is it A, the water changes the value of the elastic limit on this spring. So now that it's wet, it does return to its original length. Or is it B, metal shrinks in water, just like your woolly jumpers do. Is it C? This spring is made of a special type of metal, one that remembers a preset shape. Or is it D? The water oxidizes the metal, causing it to contract. Do you decide. Go on, click on one.